people, it happened again. Another person shot in Bellevue. This time, a man showed up at a gas station on Highway 70 asking for help. Just this weekend, another person was shot at a park. Local News 2's Nikki McGee said, explains their concerns. For some Nashville natives, it's a surprising part of town to see gun violence. I've lived here for 28 years, never really had many issues growing up. For others, Bellevue feels like a different place than the west side of town they grew up with. It has gotten so bad here that it's just not safe here anymore. Monday morning was the latest case of gun violence, with a man showing up to a gas station along Highway 70, injured and looking for help, according to police. Just two days prior on Saturday, also in Bellevue, police say a victim sitting in a parked car at a park was shot. Both shootings follow a shootout at the end of last month when an 18 year old died and a 17 year old boy was critically injured. Being so close together, it's incredibly surprising. It just came out of nowhere for me, but I've heard people rumblings around that they feel like crimes happening more and more here and all throughout Nashville. Police data shows at this time last year, West Precinct had seen just two people either hurt or killed by gunfire. For 2024, the number has increased to five. I mean, you try to, keep, no matter where you're at, keep aware, but a lot more than used to here, that's for sure. You keep an eye on where you're at and who's around you. John Lewis and Kathy Thompson say, although they still frequent Bellevue, they've chosen to move to Cheatham County. However, they hope to see Bellevue return to the town they fell in love with. This is not the same town that it was that I moved into with my mom and daddy. Metro Nashville West Precinct officers tell us they don't believe any of these shootings are related and they believe the suspects are coming from outside of Bellevue. They are also working on crime reduction initiatives this week following these two recent shootings.